Hi, this is Macintosh here from the music team at St Mary's. This video is all about music lessons and music opportunities and that are available to you next year. And I'm standing outside the music block, uh, which as you can see, is right in the middle of the site here at St Mary's. So this is the, the in the middle of the school, it's the, the, the hub for all musical activity. It's where you'll need to be for your lessons, for your rehearsals, for storing your instruments and everything music based that goes on in school. So let's pop in and have a look. So firstly, uh, up on the wall we've got a big TV screen which is where we'll put messages and information for you about events and rehearsals and things that are going on. So it's really important to check up there when you walk in. Uh, as you come into the music department, the really important place for you to check is the timetables for your instrumental lessons. So up on this wall here, each teacher's got their own little section um, and they'll put their timetables up for your lessons. Now your lessons won't be at the same time each week. So it's really important that when you come in, you check what time your lesson is. Um, and you should probably check the day before to make sure that you're well prepared for what you're doing. When you do arrive at school, if you play an instrument that you have to carry into school with you um, on the bus or when you get dropped off, uh, first thing in the morning you make sure you bring that in. You don't have to carry it around school all day. Uh, you leave it securely in our instrument store cupboard, which is this uh, cupboard here, um, where you will find um, lots of shelf space and floor space for your instruments um, and you need to make sure it goes nicely stacked on the shelf, not on the floor, not in the pile of the door, nicely on the shelf so you know where it is for your lesson. So now I'm going to hear from each of the instrumental teachers that we have here at St Mary's College, uh, some of whom you may know already, uh, and they're going to tell you a little bit about themselves, the instruments that they teach, and all the opportunities that they can help you get involved in next year. Hi everyone, I'm Mr Yandi Nardi, I am the brass teacher here at St Mary's alongside Mr McEwen. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing all my year sixes coming up next year, there's quite a few of them who have had some great lessons online so I'm looking forward to carrying them on in person here. Um, to any new students, hit us up, yeah brass lessons, we've got trombones, we've got trumpets, euphoniums, basses, they're all out there, yeah we'd love to have you up here, we run loads of ensembles, we have a beginner brass ensemble, if you're not quite comfortable yet or maybe you're about grade 1 to grade 3 standard, we have our regular brass ensemble for students of above that level and we have grade 1 and grade 5 theory classes so it's bound to be a great next year, can't wait to see you all, see you soon. Hi there, I'm Mr Brown, one of the guitar teachers at St Mary's College, I teach many styles of guitar and I also run a guitar club on a lunch time. Look forward to seeing you in September. Bye for now. Hello. My name's Mr McEwen and I'm one of the brass teachers at St Mary's College. As you can probably see, I'm a trumpet player and I teach all the brass instruments. To my existing pupils, we'll be looking forward to seeing you all again help you as best I can to be the best brass players that you can be. To any new pupils who are coming, again, really looking forward to meeting you and helping you to do the best that you can. At St Mary's College, I also run the Senior Brass Ensemble. So when you become a bit more advanced, I look forward to seeing you there. See you all in September. Bye. Hi guys. My name is Miss Vigars and I am the percussion and drum kit teacher at St Mary's College. Quick message for anybody who is interested in playing the drum kit, drums, or playing any percussion. So by percussion I mean um, any instrument like this large instrument down here. Uh, this is my xylophone um, and at St Mary's College we've also got a marimba, a vibraphone, some timpani, which are used in, in orchestras, um, congas, bongos, samba drums. A message for any of my students at um, primary schools who've been having percussion lessons with me with their gospel and drum pad. What we will do is move you up to now the larger instruments like the xylophone, which I just showed you. And if you are interested in playing the drum kit, we will move you on to the drum kit as well. Um, I run a percussion ensemble. Um, and if anybody is interested in joining this percussion school, please do come see me, please do come and join along. 
And what we do is we're about a group of six or seven people come together and we play all the percussion and drum kit instruments all together in a large group. And we perform concerts at St Mary's College, at the Albemarle Music Centre, and we do festivals and things like that. Yeah. So a top tip for um, coming up to St Mary's, coming up to secondary school, for any student to year seven is coming up. Um, I would say just get involved, be involved, be involved in, P in, in the PE and all the sports groups, be involved in art, music, be in all the ensembles as much as you can um, because this is the time for you to experiment, see what you like, see what you enjoy, so just get involved in all the time. Alright, take care, bye! <laughs> Everybody. Miss Gent here. I'm one of the violin teachers at St Mary's College and I'm very much looking forward to welcoming the Year Sixers when you join us in September. I think it will be wonderful to have my older pupils back, my Year Sixers, who I haven't seen for a few weeks now and it's going to be wonderful to meet all the new pupils who are joining St Mary's College and other schools too. I take a group at St Mary's College called Keltia. It's an Irish fiddle band and I'm always looking forward to new pupils joining us and it may be that you're one of the pupils who think that you might have an interest in Irish folk fiddle music. Um, I have a top tip for you. My top tip is don't be afraid. See if you can come along in September ready to play, ready to make music. If you haven't been playing very much over the summer and these last few weeks, don't worry about it. Don't be too afraid. We're going to get your fiddles out, we're going to get playing, making music and enjoying ourselves. Looking forward to seeing you in September. Bye! Hello everyone, my name is Mr Law. I'm the piano teacher at St Mary's College. I'm very much looking forward to meeting you all in September and starting our piano journey together. If you already played the piano, remember to try and play something every day, even if you're not actually practicing something. That's the best tip for becoming a good musician. Hopefully see you in September. Bye. Hello, I'm Miss Penny and I'm currently one of the singing teachers at St Mary's. Now I understand that the transition process is taking place virtually this year and that when you're transferring schools or even just changing teachers that can feel a bit daunting at first but not to worry we're a friendly bunch and we'll help you settle in really quickly. Now aside from the lessons there is plenty to do in the music department. Number one for me is choir, choir, <laughs> where we would be covering a range of styles, potentially something outside of your comfort zone, and putting on performances. But apart from that, there are instrumental groups, there's a theory class, heck, you can make your own ensembles if you want. Just remember that come September, there will be plenty of singing opportunities for you to sink your teeth into. I want to advise you to just keep practicing, keep on making music, Singing is one of those skills that can really drop if you go months without doing anything. You just need to be doing a little bit every day and we'll keep on making progress. So, see you in September and stay safe. Hi everyone. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Mrs Waldock. I teach the cello and the double bass. And I'm really looking forward to seeing you all at St Mary's in September. Whether you already have lessons with me, or whether you know me already from string days but you've never been taught by me yet don't don't worry just come find me and um, we'll get things going and for those of you as I say who fancy a go but have never had a go you know, complete beginners then we welcome you with open arms yeah so as far as cello playing is concerned we have the cello group which happens on Mondays at 4 30 um, that is actually the day that we normally have lessons as well so hopefully that will still be the case in september we're not completely sure yet but hopefully that will make sense because then you'll have your cellos in already um, that is my main tip for you actually is just get stuck in come along take part in everything to do with all the musical activities that are going on in school and you'll meet a whole host of really friendly people right across from year 7 up to year 13. So hopefully I'll see you soon and um, have a great summer, 
have a good relax. Play your instruments from time to time. Say hello to them. Keep them feeling loved. And um, I will see you in September. Bye for now. Hi, I'm Mr Woodcock, guitar teacher at St Mary's College. Some of you may recognise me from St Charles and St Mary Queen of Matters. You may even have had lessons at Ensley or St Mary's with Mr Honhold. It would be great to see the students who we teach already continue with taking guitar lessons when you start Year 7 at St Mary's College and continue the great work that you've already started. If you haven't had lessons with us before, it'd be equally as great to see some new students coming along. I'm sure once we start in September, there'll be plenty of opportunities to come along and have a chat. As well as lessons, there'll be opportunities to be involved in gig nights and band rehearsals amongst other things we'll be doing over the next year. Moving up to secondary is a big step, especially as you've missed out on the last few months of year six. Learning an instrument, whether it's the guitar or any other instrument, is a great way to meet other like-minded people. If you have any questions, please come and see us when we start in September. I look forward to seeing you. Take care for now. Hello, my name is Mr Todd. I am a clarinet and music theory tutor at St Mary's. I'd like to welcome all the new students to the school, as well as any new clarinet students. If you've not had a go at the clarinet, I'd recommend coming and having a go. The clarinet is such a great instrument in that it can play in any genre of music, from pop, jazz, blues, to classical music. My lessons are tailored individually, so I'd like to develop the fundamentals of the playing first, and then look at your musical taste, develop it, and look at your repertoire. My top tip for John in this school is to enjoy the learning experience, to try as many extracurricular activities as possible. Bye for now. Hi there everybody, my name is Mr Thompson and I'm a woodwind teacher at St Mary's. My main instruments are the saxophone, the flute and the clarinet and I really look forward to meeting new students coming up to us in year seven and helping them develop on their professional music journey, uh, particularly students I may not have met yet coming from other feeder primaries and obviously continuing to teach the students that uh, I've taught at primary school up into secondary school. My main aims are to help you develop as professionally as possible to be the best performer you can be. Look forward to seeing you all in September. Bye bye. Hello, I'm Mr Newton and I teach voice, piano and a little bit of woodwind sometimes. Um, I like to work in any genre, so we could be looking at classical, jazz, musical theatre, whatever you like, doing some improvisation or composing, it's really up to you. And um, to finish, my, my bit of advice is no matter who you are or, wh or what you're planning to do at St Mary's, join the choir. Because singing makes everyone feel better. It's so, so good for us, both mentally and physically. So, there you go. I look forward to meeting you um, if you're new in September. Bye-bye.